What's good YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. JD here with yet another video for you guys. Halloween. Halloween sneakers. Not entirely a new concept. We've seen Nike been doing this for years now. And this year, they've decided to put that concept on the sneaker of the moment. Of course, that is the Nike Dunk Low. And that's exactly what I'm going to be reviewing in this video. I will be talking about the Nike Dunk Low Premium Halloween. What's good guys for all my long-term viewers welcome back and if this is your first time on the channel my name is josh i do sneaker reviews i drop at least three videos a week so make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel hit that red button down below in this video i'll be breaking down the latest halloween themed sneaker from nike these dunk lows i'll get into the colorway of course we'll talk about the quality of the shoe and also those little extras that make the shoe special we'll look at what these are going for right now and of course as always i will be giving you guys that on feed look so make sure you stick around until the end of this video. So the Nike Dunk Low Premium Halloween. As you can see by looking at the colorway of the shoe, the colorway does not get any more Halloween. Of course, we got black, orange, white. Yeah, definitely Nike came correct with the colors on this. It's definitely a very clean colorway. I actually think you can wear this shoe even when it's not Halloween season. It's a pretty nice, clean fall colorway. Of course, the main reason, however, that people want this shoe is not just because of the colorway. Of course, it's because this sneaker glows in the dark. And yeah, as you can see, the outsole glows very, very bright, which is definitely very cool. The upper as well has different images on it that does glow in the dark, as you can see from these pictures. I tried my best to get some video footage of the glowing upper on my camera, but the camera just simply couldn't pick that up. Very difficult to pick it up on camera, mainly because it glows very faintly. You can barely see it. It definitely doesn't glow as bright as the bottom. I probably need one of those black lights to be able to see this on camera. Unfortunately, I don't have one of those, but I know now, probably for the future, I should maybe get one of those, especially for these sneakers that glow in the dark. But as you can see from these pictures, the upper is full of these glowing eyes, which does look pretty cool, especially on the back of the shoe. Those two eyes at the back looks really dope. Quite a unique sneaker for sure. There's actually also going to be another Nike SB Dunk, another Halloween themed shoe dropping next week. And that is this Mummy Dunk, which PJ Tucker, who is the NBA king of sneakers, he said that that dunk was the dunk of the year so far. I could see why, definitely. It's a very unique, very well executed concept. Definitely hoping to cop myself a pair of those. Let's talk about the quality of the sneaker. This sneaker does have the word premium in the name. So I was expecting definitely better leather than we have on most of the general release dunks this year. But the leather is honestly not that impressive. I actually don't see much of a difference between this leather and the general release pairs. So in that sense, it is a bit disappointing, especially because the retail price of this pair was a bit higher than your normal dunks. Sizing on these, these fit me just like pretty much every other dunk. So for me, that is true to size. So you want to go about a half size up higher than a pair of Air Force Ones, for example. This was surprisingly quite a limited shoe. I saw it release on the Nike sneakers app. That's how I was able to get it. But very little to almost no other retailers I've seen, at least here in Europe, were able to get the sneaker. We didn't see any other raffles. Maybe it was a sneakers app exclusive. Maybe it was just a delayed release. Not entirely sure. Once I find out, I will leave that in the description. Let's look at prices right now. Prices on these are actually really high right now, especially in the men's sizes. These are going for over double retail. A bit surprised myself with the high resale price, especially considering it's not like a overly crazy concept for a Halloween shoe. I guess also the prices reflect the fact that these were a bit more limited than people expected. I'm actually expecting the prices on these to even increase over time. We saw these Halloween dunks that released last year. Prices on those when they first released really were pretty low. And we can look at those right now. They've jumped nearly double what they were last year. It's a bit risky to say whether or not you should buy these right now because I, once again, I'm not sure if they're going to release on a wider scale. But if they are really just going to be one of those sneakers app only releases, then yeah, expect the prices on these to go up even higher. So in that case, it makes sense to buy right now. So let's wrap this thing up overall. What do I think of the Nike Dunk Low in the Halloween colorway? It is a clean colorway, however, I will say the quality is not as good as I expected. And also the upper, it doesn't glow as brightly as it does in pictures. It glows definitely a bit dimmer in person. And personally, if I am going to spend my money on a pair of Halloween dunks this year, I feel those mummy dunks are the ones you want to go for. 
to me a much nicer and much more memorable pair. So for me, these are a pass, but let me know down in the comments, what do you guys think of this pair right here? It is a nice colorway, it's a pretty clean colorway, but I'm not sure if I would drop 300 on them though, but once again, let me know down in the comments, what do you guys think of this pair right here? Make sure you are following me on Instagram, that is where I drop a ton of content and I respond to pretty much anyone who messages me on there. The on feed about to drop right now, thank you guys so much for stopping by and I will see you next time. Peace.